Hey guys, today we're checking out this really cool guitar. Uh, it's a signature model by a guitar player slash singer songwriter uh, named Jared James Nichols. And I'd heard that guy's, I'd heard his name before, but I never really went and checked him out because um, I don't know why. I just, if you're on YouTube and you, and the, if, if you watch guitar videos, you've heard of this guy before. As soon as I got this guitar, I went and looked at a bunch of his stuff. He's pretty killer. He's got a lot of hair. He rocks. It's like a blues rock thing he's doing. Um, he probably should have been born in the late era 70s, so he could rock in the 80s, because that's kind of what, <laughs> what he looks like. But that's cool. I dig it. Um, this is an awesome guitar. This is a shred machine, for me at least. Uh, I, I liked playing this guitar because it just played like a shredder to me. Uh, I think he's more of a bluesy guy. Uh, I tried putting some blues into my thing, but I was just like, man, this just feels so good. And the way the tone I'm getting is great. Anyway, this is a uh, Epiphone. Uh, kind of cool. He has a, like a white back headstock painted white with his signature on the back. He's got a little thing right here that says blues power. Kind of cool looking. Just one P90 in the bridge with a tone control and a volume. And that's all you need. This thing sounds amazing. It's got a mahogany body and neck with an ebony fingerboard with Grover tuners. And this thing is just a player's dream. Uh, let's check it out. Uh, really not a whole lot of settings I can show you guys because one volume, one tone, that's it. But we'll roll the, we'll roll the tone back a little bit. stays in tune really well. Here's with some more gain. I guess let's just loop something, you guys.
All right, guys, thanks for watching. This has been the Jared James Nichols Les Paul by Epiphone. Comes with a case, soft, kind of a hard, hard, soft, shellish case. And um, gloss is not, it's not, it's kind of more of like satin finish, like aged looking black to it. Uh, you guys, let me know what you think in the comments. I, when I first got this guitar, I was like, oh, this is kind of cheesy. I don't know who this guy is, this Jared James Nichols guy. I mean, I'd heard of him before. But now I'm going to go check him out some more. And I was really inspired by his guitar. So that's an amazing thing. That's a good thing. Uh, Epiphone did an excellent job with his guitar. If you have a chance, go check it out. Um, and thanks for watching. Again, like and subscribe and hit the bell. I'd really appreciate you guys. And we will see you on the next video. See you.